All right, and we're back. We're here in Imsvale in Umar Hills. Finally ready to look for the ranger's cabin, and uh, hopefully we'll find Corthala's cabin as well. But uh, not even sure if we've seen everything in the village. Not sure we uh, necessarily need to either. So here was the mayor's house. Dar. Don't know if he's working and this is uh, some establishment or this is his house. Nature's servant awaits. Hmm? Ask you who he is. Saying he's nobody important. Nobody important enough that my love's father might vaguely consider allowing me to court her. He doesn't want to hear about this. All right. <laughs> May you fare better than I. So, a heartbroken uh, Emsvale resident. Jermian's home. All right, so it's not a uh, place of business. Okay. Maybe that's his love's home. What? Well, he's not even going to wish him luck with that one. Thousband, Derbert, and Neller. Looks like they're up to no good. Yes? <laughs> wow, an adventurer. Alright, sounds like kids. They want to be adventurers. Thousband wants to be a ranger. Other wants to be a warrior like his father. Everyone says they're too young. <laughs> Bull, that's what I say to that. Ask, actually asking Lily to buy them swords. Bastard swords. <laughs> and some ale. Thousand's asking for. Don't forget the ale. Wants to be real men. I guess they're all boys. You know what? <laughs> I think uh, for Lily's own amusement, even if it gets them killed, <laughs> I think she'll do this. They want swords and ale, <laughs> let them have it. Even at their own peril. As long as they pay for it, I guess. Which it sounds like they will. They want three bastard swords. Oh, okay. And that famous uh, Balor's Ale from Min Minling. <laughs> so excited. All right, 200 gold. I guess, um, well. I await your need. Be quick with it. I think uh, Corgan's gonna have to be Aaron Boy on this one. Greetings, good customer. A pearl to you. Three bastard swords. That was, uh, depleted her bastard sword stock. Useful gadgets I have. Yes, I do. Here's the ale. All right. Corrupting uh, youth. All right. Baylor Ale and our bastard swords. Wow, you're the best. Talking, I guess, to Corgan. <laughs> Dips on the ale. All right. 
Let's go, they're saying. So. <laughs> oh, they're going into that house. Alright. I think Lily was expecting them to go out adventuring. <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised then uh, if they did, if we'd find them. Uh, what is it? Perished somewhere else. Out in the real world. Kachi. A little girl, Margie. Two herders. What? You're a stranger. I'm asking who the little girl is. Came her with her parents to flee the bad people who were killing everybody. When she grows up, she wants to be a mighty warrior. Her parents think she's telling stories, but she saw something. I was bringing the cows home a couple of weeks ago, but I was bringing them through the path in the woods because it's faster, even though I guess her mother doesn't like her doing that. Passing by the ranger's cabin, which we're actually looking for, Morella's. Apparently Morella's been nice to her, <laughs> always giving her candy that she makes out of tree sap. She also took her fishing once. <laughs> Typical conversation with the child. Alright. Back uh, onto what she witnessed. She saw this big black shadow coming out of the cabin, leaving a big trail of red stuff, which looked like blood. It looked like a wolf monster. She told her parents, but uh, they didn't believe her. If you went to the cabin, I bet you'd find something. <laughs> Just to the west of the village. All right. Out in the valley. Yes? Speaking with these uh, villagers. And who might you be? Not really curious uh, who she is, is more about what they know. She thinks it's the wolves. Mauling and stealing corpses. They've been around for several years, but they've never been this bad. Some people are blaming the ogres. She doesn't believe it, though. Talking about uh, fanciful tales of Umar. Even my daughter, Kachi. Alright, so this is uh, Kachi's mother. Coming up with wild stories. Alright, she's convinced it's the wolves. What? Jeb. I am ready. Here's where those kids were. I guess this is uh, some river. This must be the end of the village. Alright. So I guess finally stepping out of Imsvale. Yes? Going west, looking for the ranger's cabin. Right, we're still in the village. Here's... Uh, Anna Hendrick, I guess, and her husband look like uh, chicken farmers. It is about time. Well met and welcome. Sounds like a silly question, but ask her what the chickens are, in case they're not chicken farmers. Why not? Can't leave the farm to rot completely. I have to eat. and welcome. Here's what you might know about the murders. Saying it's no longer safe out by the farms. She knows nothing else about it. All right. What is it? <laughs> Just Lily's uh, eyeing, eyeballing them because one might be a mage. All right. Well, there's some natural crossings, but before
Fork across, I guess, to the other side. We'll, uh... Speak your mind. Make sure there's no other cabin, because we're also looking for, yeah, Krathala's cabin. Some wildlife. What's those rabbits? Oh, okay. <laughs> Back in the village. Alright. What? Nature's servant awaits. Maybe it's uh, the ring of animal friendship. Is that true? I don't know why I keep thinking that uh, Jahira should be able to speak with animals. What? All right. Maybe she needs a ring for that. All right. Yeah, otherwise, really, we have no idea where we're going. In fact... As I have said before, you could not have made a better choice. I await your need. Wow. It was a moose. I actually saw a moose uh, the first time in person when I was hiking in Vermont. I can tell you, it's uh, pretty intimidating just how large they are. And I'm sure uh, they only get larger the further north you go, probably towards Canada, to Nova Scotia and places like that. Aye, this be a grand enough lot. Mayhap I won't be needing to kill y'all any time soon. <laughs> Corgan sounding awfully cheery. Here's something finally. If this is uh, a cap and it's awfully large. Ranger cabin. Alright, Morella's. Yeah, look how big this place is. Alright. Certainly not very inviting. I am ready. All the world is blind to my passing. I think Yoshimo's gonna make sure uh, we're actually alone. Nobody else is here. Actually, it looks like a, a corpse on the bed. It looks as if a violent struggle has taken place here. Someone was killed and dragged out of the cabin. There are a few footprints in the blood. They appear to be dog or wolf prints. Oh, it seems like we're alone. Looks like a note here. A note from Mazzy Fenton. Of course, this is the uh, adventurous, famous adventurous. To Waleg. Not sure who that is. Traveling out to search for the wolf lair. Confirming Morella's suspicions that there's a large pack of wolves acting in the area. On the map included, I have indicated where I believe the wolf den to be located. Follow us if you can. Until we meet again. Signed, Mazzy. On the same sheet is drawn a crude but effective map which indicates the path to a forested area several hours north of the Imsvale region of the Wolf Den. Alright. 